Okay, this makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. About two months ago, this board had a scratch on it, and I determined it dead. It would not boot up with either a Core i5 4690K or an Intel Pentium G3220. But now when I test it, like, I put the Hall of Fame Edition GTX in here, and then another um, card with a back plate so I could see how it would fit in a similar board. And then after the test was successful and I could run them like that, um, I looked at the bottom just to be sure it was actually dead. And I couldn't find a scratch. The one thing I found that I thought was a scratch was actually just like some of the tracers going like that. So there was no scratch. And now, powering it on. It receives power and goes to BIOS. So I, I currently have no idea what happened, but I guess I'll let bygones be bygones. I'll throw this into a system or something. Get a stock cooler on it, then make sure it's still alive, then put more memory in it, then make sure it's still alive. And I'm going to make sure this is still alive every step of the way because I don't trust this board. It wouldn't show video before, and now it does. I don't know what I did differently. I, ju I didn't do anything different, actually. I just shoved the random heatsink on that had some thermal paste. And then that got that mess of a heat spread, but whatever. If it works, it works. I guess fool me once, shame, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. And I wasn't fooled twice. So shame on you, motherboard. You're bad and dusty. Hmm. Well, before it ends up falling off, so it's time to start unplugging. Woohoo. Anyways, this board is back from the dead.